still continue the fight. This one might lose. Why? Oh, Matrix gets used. Nice oh, immortality. Really field. Shallow angle here. And look at this. Yeah, the immortality field keeping the ball up. Hardy gets burnt down. Ultimate traded for the life. He's going to be coming back off the respawn shortly because the overtime burns. It's a dangerous situation for them. Gargoyle also look at him at that high ground position. And they've got this beautiful pincer. A lot of damage coming off at all these different angles. Looking for the right time to let the Snatterbush go. There you go. The timing comes through. They coordinate it, but no one was ready for that. And Matrix into the damage boost. The Dead Eye, they didn't have time to react, Josh. Taking the fight to them just as they're trying to set up, despite the fact the Outlaws have the speed of Lucio, it's not getting him in the position that they want to be in. Here's a coalescence, the Outlaws just get stuffed into that corner, and BQB gets the death blossom. The bomb really helps him set up that fight. Gargoyle D mech and dealt with by Helix Rocket BQB heroics. No, defense matrix kind of silence. Uh, no, Unless I mean, yeah, this is what I mean by no. I mean they they have Yaki up on the high ground on the McCree, and he's been able to get behind them on the high ground, then drop down. Fear on this widow. Another safe position behind. He stalls and it gets Dante. This guy is sharp as attack. You can't just fight this if you're the Houston Outlaws with the walls. Oh. He is on fire, man. 